What's up team? We came out to the desert to detonate the most explosive play button ever. Like I said, it's just, it's so dangerous that we couldn't do it like in the city. So we literally had to come out to the desert where there's no people, there's nothing to catch on fire, except for me. Um, and so if you guys remember, here we go, we made this, the, the most explosive play button. It's right here, sitting in its nice safe oil. I actually have some extra in this little, little bin right here, also sitting in mineral oil. Now, the reason I have that is because when we were making this play button, the first time they delivered it to me, it was like cut up in chunks. I couldn't make the play button correctly, and so I've never worked with sodium, and so we're gonna do a couple tests before we actually drop this mother load, because I wanna get a sort of a feel for exactly how explosive it is. So we're gonna fill this up with water, um, we're gonna do a couple tests to see you know, what happens, and then we're gonna go ahead and put that in a big tub, and it's gonna be the most explosive play button ever. And on this shoot, safety is the number one priority. But for real, it really is. So um, let's get to exploding. All right, so just like when we did this with the potassium, I'm gonna go ahead and cut a little chunk and I'm gonna put it in here. And then I'm gonna zip tie it up, like so. And then we're gonna stick it right down in there in that water. It's really light, it doesn't, it doesn't weigh much. I just don't want to touch it because the moisture on my fingers, it'll actually burn your fingers. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, putting her in. That goes test number one. <laughs> Our first test was incredibly explosive. Um, it destroyed the container right off the bat. Uh, so now we gotta figure something else out. Um, the one thing I wanna make sure um, that I'm curious about is like, when we did this last time with the potassium, it was highly reactive to even us just spraying it with water. So I'm really curious about how reactive it is just with water coming at it. Let's take a look and see what happens. Burn a hole right through the table. One thing that I've noticed is that the sodium reacts very differently than the potassium. Potassium, like as soon as water hit it, it kind of burst into flames immediately, and there were sparks, and like it was really colorful. This is like it takes a lot for it to work up to to actually catch on fire. Um, I think what actually happened on our spray test is that when we sprayed it, it kind of mixed in sort of with the plastic. The plastic started catching on fire. The, the water was fueling the sodium, which then was fueling the plastic fire. It was just a mess. So we're gonna go ahead and take a half pound, throw it in here, and then that'll be our last test before our most explosive play button ever. All right, let's get to it. If you guys remember, what happens is if you just throw the sodium on there, like it, it kind of sinks in the water, but it also kind of like, it, it could potentially sit up top because it's producing that hydrogen gas and it kind of just like floats around on top. And that's, we don't want that. We want it to get down into the water and we want it to explode. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill this balloon up with sand. Now the reason we're doing that is because the weights before were lead and the thing that we're about to uh, toss in there is explosive. So we don't want huge chunks of lead coming towards us. All right, what we're gonna do is we're gonna combine these two pieces. I think it's about half a pound. What do you guys think? Yeah. It's a big boom boom. It's gonna be a big boom boom. I gotta admit, team, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm pretty nervous about this one. That's a lot of sodium, a lot. I'm gonna dunk this in there and just run. R-U-N, I'm not even gonna look back. I'm just gonna run. All right, here we go. My heart's still, still beating. It was so loud, it's like, I'm, I'm wearing earplugs and there was still a ring. It was so loud. I didn't look back. Uh, the table is almost completely destroyed at this point. Um, if you look at the actual, let's go look at the carnage. All right, so there's still a big piece down here at the bottom that did not react. I'm gonna take that and put that over and time out over here. That was insanely explosive and that was not even all of it. The 
Here's the little pieces of our container right here. There's one, there's one, there's one. That was so scary. That was so intense. I am so nervous to put a pound in the water. I'm like really, really nervous. But we have this special mechanism that we're gonna use on this one. We have a pull pin so that I don't have to, I don't have to like stand here close and pull it. What I can basically do is I can literally just with the str string, I can just pull the string and then I can be 20 feet away. And basically what I'm gonna do is we have these blast shields over there and I'm gonna pull the string and then just duck down below. Whew, all right. Crucial part of the experiment right here. All right, the wind's kicking up. Uh, we just don't want to delay for this. Uh, really, like this, this experiment's really dangerous. We don't have room for air on this one, so we're gonna move quickly. Safely, but quickly. There we go. The big Bertha. The biggest, most explosive play button ever made. All right, say goodbye guys, hit play. Hit subscribe, subscribe and like. If you like this video, subscribe and like. All right, there we go. I'm gonna load her in place. This is the dangerous, most dangerous part of this whole thing. Once this is in place. My heart is beating out of my chest right now. Oh my God, the suspense is like seriously killing me. All right, three, two, one. <laughs> yes! Yes! No one got hurt! That was incredible! Hey, look, this guy survived. That's incredible. Can't believe that. Pieces of the uh, of the bin right there. That worked incredibly well. I'm looking around, I don't see pieces of sodium anywhere, which makes me think that it completely reacted. So the reaction went to completion. So the sodium reacts with the water. There's an electron exchange. All the electrons go to the water. The sodium is left very positively charged. It starts to repel itself just like two positively charged magnets. It explodes with excitement because it's so positive. And then the hydrogen gas from the reaction catches on fire and explodes because that reaction is also exothermic from the water and the sodium turning into sodium hydroxide and hydrogen gas and it is explosive that in fact was the most explosive play button ever made ever if you like this video go and give us a thumbs up in the comment section below let me know were you totally blown away by how explosive that one pound of sodium was and if you haven't yet hit that subscribe button because we have new videos every week and i'll see you guys really soon